Yeah, earlier when they backed off, I think they backed off because uh, he suddenly, you couldn't see one of his, oh, Oh, this, he's starting to move. Oh, now, now, now this is extremely dangerous for everyone involved. He's trying, I think, to back up against the deputy's vehicle. Ugh. This is definitely assault on a police officer yes. right now, and he, this, this is extremely dangerous for the driver. This is, he's not going to move a sheriff's patrol vehicle. He's, <laughs> he's just not, and you can see now he's burning the tires out. Uh, and uh, boy, this is how you can disable a transmission or possibly ruin your truck. Um, but this deputy's vehicle is not moving. Yeah, like you said, we talked about earlier, Mark. You know, anytime you uh, try to hit or, you know, attack a deputy in his vehicle with your vehicle, that weapon uh, or that vehicle is considered a deadly weapon. So, yeah, this is a, a very serious thing. And maybe he's trying to smoke everybody out. Uh, but like you said, maybe he keeps doing this and his car will become disabled. And that would be a good thing that, you know, we know that he can't go anywhere. But we do know that he is surrounded. He has no, he can't go forward. Uh, the only way he has to go is back, which he's trying to do. It looks like he stopped. Uh, I'm sorry. I was, I'm sorry. Rich. I was just listening to some radio traffic. They, they said that they, uh, they have deployed so much uh, irritant inside of the vehicle. They don't think that any more is going to be effective. Wow. So uh, th that's what they were. Th they're discussing the next phase of this tactic because it's just not convincing this driver to to surrender.